हेलो एंड वेलकम टू दी वीडियो लेक्चर ऑन एक्सपोनेंशियल कुरियर सीरीज फॉर द रेक्टेंगुलर वेव फॉर्म विच इज शोन इन द फिगर सो दिस वेव फॉर्म इज हैविंग एन एम्पलीट्यूड ऑफ ए द फंडामेंटल टाइम पीरियड इज टी जीरो एंड इट द वेव फॉर्म लिमिट्स विल बी फ्रॉम माइनस टाउ बाय टू टू प्लस टाउ बाय टू सो लेट अस कैलकुलेट द एक्सपोनेंशियल कुरियर सीरीज फॉर दिस ए द एक्सपोनेंशियल कुरियर सीरीज इक्वेशन फर्स्ट वी विल रिप्रेजेंट दैट एंड देन वी विल गो for calculating the coefficient for fourier series the exponential fourier series is given by x of t is equal to summation n is equal to minus infinity to infinity cn into e raised to j 2 pi n t divided by capital t so this is a representation and in this case we are interested in calculating this fourier coefficient cn So let us start solving this problem. Now the Fourier coefficient c n is given by the formula c n is equal to two point t integration over the period t x of t into e raised to minus j two pi n t divided by t. Now let us substitute all the values. Now from the diagram we see uh, we know that the value of this capital T is t zero, so one by t zero. Limits will be from minus tau by two to plus tau by two. Amplitude is given by a, so minus j two pi n t divided by t zero. A is a constant term. Take it outside the integration. So A divided by t zero minus tau by two to plus tau by two. E raised to minus j two pi n t by t one. Now let us take the integration. So A divided by t zero integration is E raised to minus j two pi n t by t not divided by minus j. 2 pi n divided by t zero limits will be from minus tau by 2 to plus tau by 2. so which is equal to now this t zero t zero gets cancelled so this uh, term will uh, become a divided by minus j 2 pi n in bracket now we'll put the limits. So e raised to minus j two pi n tau divided by two t naught minus e raised to minus j two pi n minus tau divided by two t naught. Now let us adjust this two uh, j inside the bracket. So this term will become. Minus a divided by pi n into e raised to minus j two two gets cancelled, so pi n tau divided by t naught minus now this minus tau and this is minus sign, so minus minus will make this plus and this two two gets cancelled, so it will become e raised to j. Two two gets cancelled, so pi n tau divided by t not divided by two j. Now let us absorb the negative sign inside the bracket, so that will make this first term negative and second term positive. So a divided by pi n into e raised to j pi n tau divided by t not minus e raised to minus j. Pi n tau divided by t naught whole divided by two j. But if you see the trigonometric identity, then this term inside the bracket represents the sine term because the identity is given by sine theta is equal to e raised to j theta minus e raised to minus j theta divided by two j. So this is the identity. So if you can see here, if you Leave this j part, then theta is pi n tau by t naught, pi n tau by t naught. So this entire term in the bracket we will replace by this sine term. 
so this will become a divided by pi n into sine of theta and theta is pi n tau divided by theta. So this is what is the value of the cn coefficient that we have calculated by using the exponential Fourier series. So sine of pi n tau divided by theta. So this is how you can calculate the exponential Fourier series for the rectangular waveform given in the bracket. So, uh, if you like my video, then please share the video with your friends and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys. Thank you so much.